Yo. Hey, Roman. Yo. I got a special delivery for you. You want to come outside? This thing is so ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Tanner? What the? Tanner. Or ow. Tanner. Yo, these corn leaves are cutting me, and I, I kind of want to go back to California, man. Who signed me up for this, dude? Like, where? What is this? Oh my god, Tanner. This is why I didn't have a bed last night, because he parked this thing. Yo, hey. Oh, yeah, what's I, up, bro? How'd you sleep in there? It's honestly not too bad. You want me to show you my setup? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I, can I come in? I, I, yeah, I yeah, yeah, please. Come night. check it out. Yeah, come yeah, check yeah. it out. Yeah, this is where I slept, man. This, this is all I got. Nice. You want to see what I got? What do you have? Where'd you sleep? Oh, right about over there. Oh, nice. You slept in the corn? Yeah, it was, it was soft. It was beautiful. Yeah. Bean bag, my blanket. I got my power up here in case I need anything. Oh, charge all your cameras. Exactly. Nice, nice. The AC. So it was nice. It was pretty. <laughs> it, was, it wasn't a bad setup at all. No, here. Um, couldn't be. Whoa. All right, good morning, Fox fam. Welcome back to another vlog. I probably have a lot of explaining that I need to do right now. Today is a very exciting day. Not only are we in a massive Ohio cornfield right now surrounded by nothing, nothing, and I mean nothing, but corn and a bean field. That is a bean field over there. That's beans? So what is going on right now is a couple of months ago, I announced to you guys that I was doing a contest with Roman Atwood, and if I lost, if I lost, I had to replace the school bus that I drove into his pond. And here we are, a couple months later, I am in Ohio. I'm like 10 minutes away from Roman Atwood's house, guys. I mean it when I say I am in the middle of absolute nowhere. And four months ago, I ordered this replacement for the school bus and I didn't tell anyone what I was doing. So we are starting today's video right now with the school bus replacement behind me and I'm about to give you guys a full tour. But before we start today's video, I want you guys to all hit that subscribe button, smash the like button because we are about to finally replace Roman Atwood's school bus that I destroyed and sunk into a pond a couple months ago. So guys, today's going to be an absolute insane upload. <sighs> should we show them around? We should show them around. I was kind of thinking when I wanted to replace the school bus, I I, I didn't want to just buy a normal school bus. Is he talking? I, I think some guy's here and... I think someone's mad that we slept in the field. I think he is. Guys, we have this, we have this big army truck. Do you want to do something? I'll, I'll step I hear a guy yelling about us being in the field. I got all this. <laughs> okay, guys. So someone I think is mad that we slept in this field. I would be mad too. It's a big cornfield. It's, it's not our cornfield. Can you hear it? Oh, yeah. Okay, let me get, let me explain to you guys what we're doing really quick before whoever this is gets really bad at us. So I was thinking. I thought it'd be I thought it'd be way too boring to just replace the school bus with another school bus. I was trying to think outside the box. I'm trying to surprise Roman because he probably thinks I'm replacing this with a school bus. I mean, all of you guys have been saying that. You all think I'm replacing the school bus with a school bus. So I bought a 1958 army truck. This is like a legitimate army truck. It has 118,000 miles on it. Like I said, this thing is over 50 years old. It is legitimate. It's insane. You can fuel this thing with not only oil, but you can put diesel, normal gas, and jet fuel in this car and it will run. So it's basically like a zombie apocalypse car. <laughs> Watch my door. It's like all made out of steel. <laughs> It makes the loudest noises. No power steering, massive. It's even manual. It's got like a giant clutch. This is a legitimate army vehicle. Like this is not a joke. It took four months for this thing to get delivered. I got it off like an auction website. It's even got all the official like tags. It has ID numbers and stuff. Yeah. Everything, what's that glove box? What's in the glove box? It's wired shut. Oh, I got it. Oh, 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 oh. What's it? Are these amazing. I don't know. Amazing. On the back of this army truck, I don't know what Roman's gonna use this thing for. He could go camping with Kane and Cora and Noah, or he could, I mean, fill this thing with fireworks or anything he wants. But let me show you what's back here. Inside here, this is obviously where I slept last night. Oh, it's really spacious. It's actually pretty nice. You just park it up wherever you want. And I mean, you're in an army truck, so who's gonna fuck with you? We got the wood framing. We got the, uh, <laughs> I act like I know what I'm talking about. We got yep, wood. That's wood. <laughs> 
It's like a giant power strip. It came inside of this. Those are expensive. I, this is really expensive. And then it comes with an AC unit. Alrighty guys, so that was a small tour of the replacement for the school bus. Now we are about to head to Roman Atwood's house. He has no idea I'm doing this. I'm so excited um, and a little scared to see his reaction. Hopefully he'll accept my gift. I mean, who wouldn't want this thing? I know he's got space for it. He's got a really, really big yard. Um, but yeah, let's go deliver this thing to Roman and get his reaction and see what we can get ourselves into today. All right, so we have a special guest. Introduce yourself. Uh, what do you want, Brian or Builder Brian? Builder Brian. Builder Brian. Okay, guys, so he's he's in on the on the little surprise here. What did that guy say? Was he? He was just like, uh, what is going on? An army truck in, in my in field? my corn in my cornfield? In my cornfield? Okay, we're all good. No problems. Let's go uh, surprise Roman, shall let's we? Let's do it. It's also very very loud in here. Huh? Huh? Uh, <laughs> got it. Got it. Oh my goodness. Okay guys, we are outside of Roman's house right now. Uh, I'm gonna give him a FaceTime call, I'm gonna let him know. He knows I'm coming, but he doesn't know what I'm bringing. So, uh... Yo. Hey Roman. Yo. I got a special delivery for you. You want to come outside? Dude, I've been waiting and waiting and waiting. <laughs> well, we're ready to do this. I'll meet you outside. You excited or what? Dude, this thing is so ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Is Tanner actually driving this? No, Brian is. <laughs> I don't know where. I don't know where Brian <laughs> went then. <laughs> do you know where the brakes are? Yeah, it's just like a regular car. Oh my god, bro. I don't know how to stop it. I love this so much. I'm here. <laughs> Good to see you. So, oh uh, here it is, your new god, school bro. bus replacement, Roman. It's a 1958. It looks like it this. holds about as much as a school bus. Oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> How'd I do? It's a little bit cooler than a school bus, right? Is it? It looks cooler. I've, I haven't driven it yet. But can it can it make it through the pond though? <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna have to replace the army truck next. <laughs> I gotta show him the back. Hey, no, we got six bags. <laughs> Dude, Check this, this is out. so sick. This is legit so sick. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's Dude, are we gonna good. camp in this tonight? We can. We should camp. This thing it's is so ten awesome. wheel drive, bro. All the wheels move. This is so much cooler than a school bus. Yeah, not right. We can't destroy this. That's right. This thing's so legit. Oh. We finally delivered it <laughs> four months later. <laughs> oh, everyone thought I wasn't going to actually replace the school bus. Dude, you did. People were asking me when I was doing this, I mean, and I had to keep it a secret. Years. I did. It did take me a very, very long time. Is it hard to drive? Yeah, it's so difficult. It's manual. It's manual. <laughs> That's why it sounded like it was. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, Holy cow, dude. This is man. so dope. This is seriously the sickest truck. I'm hyped you love it, because I was a little worried you were going to... Are you kidding me? This is like... Us. So what do you think? What are you thinking? Oh my god, dude. I don't know. What do you... Yeah, what do you I mean, mean, What do you even do, do with this? Exactly, what do you do with it? I don't even know. Go crazy. It goes 60. It does? It will go 60. I, I mean, that's what it says. We got it up to about 35, but it flies. It really does. 35? <laughs> <laughs> but it feels like you're going 80. <laughs> yeah, it feels like you're going 80. And, and, and you got your number plate on here. It's the GTR in it. Oh. Oh. <laughs> GTR bumper pull? So yeah. Oh my God, let's go, dude. All the way from, I don't even know where this came from. You didn't tell me. Is that where it came from? Philadelphia is where you bought it. But I don't know where it came from. Philadelphia all the way to Ohio. To right here, for this actually, moment, right now. I ordered I it in February. This, truck. this thing's so sick. I'm glad you like it. We'll have to go uh, test her out and do some off-roading. It fits my house so well. It does, huh? I think it's just part of the house now. Right. This is the surprise? You want to go play with it today? Yes. Yes, play? Yeah, and it's raining. This, what are we gonna mud bath it? We have to. I think that's that would make the most sense, right? I got just the spot, dude. Well, let's do it. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Do you have the Do you have the Carfax on this? No, I left them at home. Actually, you don't have it. Clean title, though. Any Any accidents? No, never race. Two thousand miles is almost brand new. Okay. Okay. Yeah. What about the headlights? The headlights work? Yeah, yeah. I'm the first owner. I've treated it super. Garage kept. Really? Yeah, super nice. Never, no, nothing. Okay. Okay. This should work for the uh, for the army truck. Alrighty guys, so we showed up to Roman's property 
And like I said before, there's this random Jeep that's right here. And we have the massive, oh my God, he's going through here. Here we go. Oh, here we go, here we go. Bro, I mean, this is a little, this is a little cooler than the, than the school bus. Oh, I, I love have to it, say. dude. Like nothing. This it just the, moved that Jeep as if it wasn't even there. This is the real cool bus. All right, I'm thinking second thumbnail option here. We, I, I we do wrecked too. an army truck. Oh it's my like God, I can't straight even talk. Kruger kind of Kruger back again. Yeah, but it was already Josh. <laughs> oh no, it was. Woo! Let's go. What are you doing? My gosh, dude, this thing can can get through anything. Anything, dude. I thought we were gonna get stuck. Real oh, talk. There were some spots where my buggy was like this, and that thing's like. Oh my god, we're in the middle of nowhere. I think it's safe to say this was a good replacement for the school bus. Wow, unreal. So, if we could just take a moment to just say rest in paradise to my white vans. Rest in peace to, to the white vans. vans. All right, don't mind us. Ryan's just chopping down a tree really quick so we can get through. Just normal thing. did break. There it is. Only thing to break. There it is. The mirror. It's not even broke. Just yeah. the bolt came out. Alright guys, so we just found this like little creek on the side of the road right here or like in the middle of the forest. We were gonna bring the army truck through the creek to kind of see if it could handle the water. Pretty sure it can. I am blown away at the performance of this army truck. I had no idea what I was getting myself into when I bought this thing. I was just kind of trying to think of a cool way to replace the school bus. But sure enough, we have a legitimate military grade vehicle. Back her up, back her up, you're in the water. There you go, back her up. Can she take it? Army truck, army truck versus lake bed. What will happen, let's find out. Here you go. You're gonna back her up and then you're gonna full send through the lake bed. Well, I'm gonna come through down there and then I'm gonna come through here. Oh! Oh my god! He fully said that! <laughs> Alright, wrapping up the giant army truck session in the middle of the jungle. Roman. How do you I'm, like your gift? I'm blown away. Blown away? I awesome. truly am too. This is more than a truck. It really is. <laughs> it can do anything, dude. This is a survivalist dream right here. I was not expecting this to do much when I bought it. I, I just kind of like, I want to replace the school bus. Cool. Exactly. It, it looks cool. cool. And then sure We enough, didn't know, 1953, the thing still starts up and runs through jungles. <laughs> Literally. Like I said, I bought it because it looked cool, but we kind of wanted to see if it was actually an army vehicle. And it is. That was a test. test. I'm starting to realize the uh, army gets better vehicles than we do. All right, guys, just like that, we're back at Roman's house. Guys, I want to say really quickly, make sure you go check so out awesome. Roman's vlog. We both have filmed all day today. So two super dope different videos. Um, go check out Roman's channel. And then tomorrow, we're going to be hanging out here in this dreamland of a backyard. So I want all of you guys to comment down below some ideas. I'm, I'm thinking we got to do the blob. 
We got to do the jumping off the top. Oh, you want to do the blob? We have to do the blob. You want to do the blob? I would love to do the blob. Fly. I want to fly. I'm going to have to call on the big guns. Okay, okay. <laughs> so I want to do the blob. Uh, maybe bring out some little boats. Bring the army truck versus pond. 100%. 100%. 100%. So guys, leave some ideas down below, but I'm going to be here tomorrow and then I go back to California. But guys, amazing day. I'm quite impressed by that truck, man. I'm thoroughly impressed. So we will see you in the next vlog. Make sure you comment ideas and subscribe to Roman. First link in the description. Do it. And hope you guys enjoyed that last vlog from Tanner. He's the coolest. Make sure everyone likes, comment, subscribe, and cop yourself some of the hottest, softest merch in the game.